What's up, Dirt Nerds? I'm George, and it is Dirt 30. Let's see what we're going to be digging into today. Alright, so yes, I know I promised some dirt. It's been cold. It's been nasty. I'm not trying to get out there after work when it's dark and I can't see nothing. I'm setting up a spot in the coin corner here so that I can do uh, kind of a indoor, outdoor kind of thing. So I'm going to be doing all that. And in the meantime, I'm over a thousand subscribers. Thank you all. This is like amazingly incredible and just mind blowing. So, uh, real quick, I just want to show you all some stuff that I got in the mail. Um, some things for, for me. And some things for you. So, I'm going to start out with some of the... Some of the U's and the kind of me's. I picked this up on eBay on auction. Uh, essentially, I paid about fourteen dollars, and I got a full roll of buffalo nickels, all buffaloes. Supposed to be random dates. I'm pretty sure it'll be all a lot of the same dates, um, but I have a buffalo nickel book here that I had one from. Uh, Tom's Gold Dirt. So I'm going to be working on filling that up. And whatever's left over, I'll be adding to my random buffalo tube for giveaways. Or sorry, for gift packs. Because I don't really want to look at this so much as a giveaway anymore as we've seen as how there's been issues with all that. These are not giveaways, these are gifts. I choose random people to receive a gift from random comments on my videos and I hope that's acceptable if not um, I'll find out so moving on I also got so I started going through different silver companies just to see what's out there um, this time I went through uh, Provident Metals picked up my uh, 10 ounce bag of shot for doing my pours got a cool little refrigerator magnet that's pretty cool. And then I got an actual, like, round container with my bag of my shot. Ooh, yeah. Do some pours real soon. I am feeling much better, obviously. Um, I've, I've been having to go to work last couple days, so uh, just doing what I do. Sweet. More mail. <laughs> so anyway, uh, I got that one from there. And then I went to JM Bullion. And if y'all don't know, a lot of bullion companies here in the United States, um, I don't know if they do international or not, but uh, they are offering a 10 ounce at spot deal for first time buyers. And I went ahead and I got one. So it comes in this cool little black silky bag. Nice little container there. It's even got a little star pump thing there. Let me grab my my coin cloth. And they are the generics. It's 10 ounces of the generic rounds. And yes, I'm not touching them because I may be giving some of these away. Probably melting them. It's hard for me to melt anything that looks this pretty and, and cool already though because I, I can't make nothing that pretty. I mean, the stuff I make's cool, but it doesn't look that pretty, though. Not, not yet. So I got that, picked that up. Very good deal to pick that up, because you pick it up pretty much at spot price, so can't beat that. And the uh, the shot I picked up at a pretty dang good deal, too. I don't really care to disclose what I paid, but it was a good deal. Oh, okay. Uh, it was like 156 I think I paid for the lot. So, not bad, not bad. Uh, another score I got from eBay. Uh, it's just I picked up a couple of coins to fill my seated liberty or my American American Historic Silver Liberty Quarter Set. It's this cool box that I found at my work, and I got oh what was the date? What is blind man? Hang on. That was an 1850 
Seated Liberty, half dime. Picked up for a very decent price. I do not recall what I paid. I do not care what I paid because this is a hole filler and I know I did not pay a ton for it. And I'm pretty sure I've already uh, posted up asking, you know, hey, did I, you know, could, yeah. So yeah, no, I, I got a good deal on it. And if I can get it to focus, probably not. It, that's a tiny, tiny little coin. <laughs> anyway, that's going into my uh, Silver Liberty quarter set or Silver Liberty coin collection. Is it's got all the seateds, um, the Barbers, the Morgan, all that. So the Walkers, the Standers. <laughs> so to help also fill that. I got a 1854-0 half dollar. It's the seated Liberty half. She is worn, but there is still some detail there. If I can get it, come on, focus on this one, please. There we go. You can still see the date. Kind of still see the girl there. You can still see a fair amount in the back. So... Pretty cool. It's another hole filler to that, that. There's one other piece coming. I will do a video for that one. Uh, that helps to fill that entire box where I'll have at least one coin in each of the different spots. All right. I think that was it for that part. So, for my gifts, I also picked up. From my good buddy over at Tom, at Tom's Gold Dirt, I picked up five of his small gold bags. They each come with a one gram silver bar in there as well. And I will be adding those to various gift bags here and there. So I picked those up for y'all. I have a few more things I'm waiting on. Probably it's what just came in the mail and my son dropped off to me. So, going to go ahead and get that handled later. Well, that'll be another video. So, real quick, I do have the 1,000 subscriber gift pack. So, for my 1,000 subscriber gift pack. We'll start off small. I got a little random pack here. There's 10 wheat, ten random wheat, wheat pennies, a couple of buffalo nickels, and some tokens. <coughs> random stuff. I'm also going to be throwing in a 1957D in brilliant condition. Wheat scent. Oops. Maybe not so brilliant now. It's in a flip. It's alright. It's protected. I will be including a 2005 D NIFC. You will also be receiving a 1966. Kennedy half. That's right. That is a 40% silver. You will also be receiving a one troy ounce. I keep doing them upside down. American bison copper round. Oh, you want more? How's about Statue of Liberty Centennial Double Eagle Commemorative Coin? That'll be in there. Hmm. Maybe more? A couple things? Maybe one, one, one or two? Three? Yeah. How about a 2001 United States? Quarter proof set. 
That includes the New York, North Carolina, Rhode Island, Vermont, and Kentucky quarter. It is not a full set. It's only, only a set of five. Slabbed with certificate and all that fun stuff. What do you think about that? You like that? Is that a good pack? That's right. I said there'd be a couple more, didn't I? How's about the Massachusetts Postal Commemorative Society sheet set? Oops. Philadelphia Denver Mint uncirculated. Stamps on the other side. All the state information. Fun stuff. Yeah, pretty good. I'll be including one of those Tom's Gold bags. There you go. Bag of dirt, gold, silver, coins, commemoratives, tokens, all kinds of craziness. This one will run a little bit longer. And no, it'll be the same. I'll give it a week. Same as always, one week. Leave a comment. That's it. Random comment generated. As always, random comment. That's it. Um, and I'm going to be announcing a different way that I'm going to be doing my, my, my gift packs um, to make it 100% open no matter what. So, uh, yeah, I think, I think y'all are dig it. And I'm going to be doing another quick video probably later tonight, probably at least tomorrow maybe, um, talking about coin roll hunting. So I've had some folks actually asking me, you know, more information about coin roll hunting. There's a lot more folks out here that are a lot more knowledgeable, but I can definitely do something and we'll figure out something and I'll do a video about that. I do have all those pay dirts as well, or the, you know, the couple that I've got going there. I have another one still ordered that I'm waiting on to show. Um, oh boy, all kinds of stuff just showed up. There's a big box. <laughs> so I'm not sure what all that is. Some of it, I believe, is gifts. We'll see what happens. All right. So you know you get that's what you got to do. Um, as always, YouTube is not responsible in any way, shape, or form for the contents of this gift pack or the contents of this video or the setup for it therein. Um, by leaving your comment and entering to try to win or to re try to enter to receive the gift pack, you release YouTube of any liability in any way, shape, or form. I am solely responsible for these gift packs and the donations that I receive are given to me by supporters and following fellow dirt nerds out there and here on the YouTube channels. So with all that said, hopefully that covers a lot of it. Um, I'm still trying to figure out how to put the links to everything down below um, to do all that because I'm again, I'm new. This is growing really quickly for me. So I'm, I'm really trying to make sure that I comply. Um, with all of YouTube's regulations and you know I'm not trying to do uh, contests or giveaways to make it look you know there's there's no money required you don't have to pay everybody is open um, the only thing I require is that uh, that you live somewhere where I can send you the gift that's it you don't even I don't I don't care if you're a subscriber I don't care if you you know you, there is no requirements other than leave a comment and live somewhere that I can give it to you. So, leave that comment. Uh, see you in a week for this. The entry time or the dates that I will be choosing the, the, the recipient will be posted in the description below. And, yeah. And I'll be seeing you soon. Have a happy, happy Thanksgiving, everybody. I will not see you tomorrow. Um, I don't think. Maybe. Who knows? Probably not. But we'll see. Either way, have a happy Thanksgiving, everybody, wherever you are. Um, if you're not in the United States, then have a happy Thursday. And we will see you on the next one. Have a wonderful day, wonderful afternoon, or wonderful evening, wherever you are. Remember, it is Dirt 30 somewhere. See you later, everybody. One more quickie. I made a foible on my last video <clears throat> where I was doing my shout out for Ray's World. Um, my head's still foggy from being sick, so I didn't even, I, I completely spaced it. 
I did not do this donation. Um, when I was there, I was just modding that day, um, and moderating his channel. I was paying attention. Okay. Miss SJ over at SJ's Mixed Adventures did a ten dollar donation in my name. Well, it did a ten dollar donation and said for me. Miss SJ is is a beautiful, wonderful person. If you have not checked out her channel, if you have not gone over and, and just hung out on one of her live streams, I highly recommend it. She's she's a very classy lady. She's very nice, and she's a really cool person. So, um, I actually have a gift pack that I'm trying to get sent to her. It's just it's it's growing big, and the bigger it gets, the more expensive it gets to send. So, I've got to get that sent soon because there's kids pack stuff and everything. She does she sends out stuff for kids for free to. To people, you know, to get them interested, you know, with with coins or other stuff, you know, that that we all out here uh, in the dirt nerd nation like to do, which is we play in the dirt, we we hunt coins, we hunt for rocks and fossils and gems and cool stuff. So Miss SJ is is one is one of us out there. Um, so I want to make sure there's a link in the description below for Miss SJ's channel. It's SJ's Mixed Adventures. So she was the one that donated to me for this. And that's where these coins came from, from Ray's World. It was actually a donation from SJ's Mixed Adventures. Which, you can see her. She's, she's, she's right here. There's SJ's Mixed Adventures right there. And right there. I got her old one and the new one. And I even got her, her, her scratch ticket business card. So, thank you again, Miss SJ. I wanted to make sure I gave you a proper thank you and shout out for, for that donation. That was most excellent. Um, and most appreciated. That was really cool. So, all right, everybody. Have a happy Thanksgiving. See you soon.